Okay, students. So here we are here to record the civil engineering afternoon session second paper that is, and the question is memory based question from the topic engineering mechanics. The question is there are two blocks, one of five kg, one of four kg, being acted upon by a force of thirty six newton. Okay, so we have to find out the contact force between these two bodies. So that is very very easy question actually. So if you look at this system. There is only one external force acting as there is a frictionless this is a frictionless surface this is a frictionless surface so there will be no friction force so there will be 36 newton acting on this particular system therefore these two will move together with a similar acceleration and that will be nothing but 36 newton this will be net force be equal to net mass into acceleration so net mass m will be addition of both that will be 9 into acceleration that is 36 and therefore our acceleration will come out to be 4 meter per second square so both the bodies will move with an acceleration of 4 meter per second square now if we cut this section or we see the FBD of this particular body 4 kg 1 <coughs> so we will see that this is also moving in this particular direction with an acceleration of a is equal to 4 meter per second square. This is of 4 kgs. So to move in this direction there should be, we have, mind you we have just taken the FBD here. So we are just seeing a part of the system that will be also in equilibrium or in an accelerated frame Newton's law can be applied and net force can be equated to mass into acceleration. Okay. So this a is equal to 4 meter per second square. This is a body of 4 kgs, so it is moving at acceleration of 4 meter per second square. So there should be an F force acting in this direction and that is nothing but the contact force. So 5 kg body will be here, this will be also acting F in this direction and F for this will be in this direction. So both summing up will cancel each other, that is why that is an internal contact force. Okay, so this F will be equal to mass into acceleration we can easily apply that is 4 into 4 which will be coming out to be 16 newtons okay so this is the answer the options in the question given were option a was 4 newton option b was 7.2 newton option c was 9 newton and option d was 16 newton the correct op option is option d that is 16 newton you can also check with the help of 5 kg body how will you check it <coughs> So this was the body, 36 was applied over here and there should be force F should be acting in this direction and that is moving with an acceleration of 4 meter per second square and that is a body of 5 kgs. So here you will say that 36 minus F will be equal to mass into acceleration 5 into 4. So F will be equal to 36 minus 5 into 4 20 that is equal to 16. Newton. So you can get from both the equations. So this is how to solve this particular question. Okay. Any queries, any doubts or any inputs from your side, then please call on this number. We are ready to help you and entertain you anytime you want. Thank you.